opportunity to drive one of my all-time favourite mid-engine sports cars, well supercars in fact, it's the Honda NSX. But before we crack on, I just want to say a big thanks to Mike from Minutia Detailing who owns this car and uh, he's given me the opportunity to actually drive this special car. Um, this is the NA2 NSX, so this is the Gen 2 car and this particular vehicle was once owned by Jensen Button. So Mike is the second owner from this NSX and he's been using it every day for the last four years. It, this is his daily car and he's covered 164,000 miles on this thing. Unbelievable. <laughs> every day he's been driving this. You know, day in, day out as a normal car. He's also tracked it, he's skidded it, he's, he's done everything, you know, he's done everything. He's used it to its full purpose and the beauty about this car is is that it hasn't cost him anything to uh, run it you know it's been completely solid it's a bulletproof car that's the beauty of Honda NSX is that's what made it so special when this car first came out it was the fact that it was the first supercar that you can use every day and it's also running 164,000 miles on an original clutch nothing has been changed on this vehicle nor is the engine either so sweet and once you get it past 6,000 rpm the VTEC sort of route oh it's an absolute delight six-speed manual gearbox feels tight steering feels absolutely lovely as well you know not that much play in it gearbox like I said again short throw nice and slick it's just aged really really well including the styling as well this car looks so subtle especially in this really nice yellow paint just a bit speechless, very, very speechless. Road car, I mean, the ride is unbelievable. You can see out of this car, you can see over the front, you can see over the rear. It's not like any other supercar with any drawbacks, you know, such as, you know, trying to find where to look out or see out of. It's, it's a road car, you know, you, you can drive this the same way you can drive a Honda Jazz, but this isn't any other Honda Jazz. We're out on the public road, so there is no sideways action or hooning today. But um, as a road car, like I said before, it just drives really, really good. I mean, I'm still surprised by how well this car drives. In fact, it's, it's, it's better than that. I was going to say it's almost Cayman, but it, no, there's something... This car has a bit more character. In fact, it has a lot more character, you know, especially with, with this mileage. And um, it's done various track days as well. Jensen Button has been hooning this car around. I'll let you listen. Wow, wow. The gearing is beautifully ratioed. The gearbox, once again, the gearbox is brilliant. And there's quite a bit of weight over the back, so the car does heave. A little bit as you take off but the power delivery is so progressive and so smooth and it, and it feels that it's on your side it's, it's not egging you on to go really quickly in it you know you can enjoy this car at sensible speeds you can just enjoy playing with the gearboxes you know and this has taken me a bit of time to get used to this car Mike has told me you know drive it you know there is a little bit of play in the uh, drive shafts and so just over age and time and what so but I like that you know you, you feel connected you feel engaged within the driving experience oh wow <laughs> sounds great so right then folks there you have it apologies for cutting out some of that footage in fact we did run out of time with that car um, it was all spur of the moment Mike 
thank you so much Manisha Detailing for letting me have a go in that amazing characterful Honda NSX. Can you believe that car's done 164,000 miles on an original clutch? It was once owned by Jensen Button and I believe Chris Harris even skidded that car about. That vehicle was in the studio of Top Gear when they did a review of the new NSX. So that's uh, pretty special within its own right. But the car itself to drive is absolutely spectacular. That VTEC engine is something of a masterpiece. Apologies for not having enough time on the Honda NSX. Let me know your thoughts and opinions of that car. To me, that's one of my favorite cars, you know, in, in well, I've got a lot of favorite cars if I'm honest, but the NSX is right up there. It is my PlayStation Gran Turismo sort of generation hero car. Sideways folks, and take care.